Let's reach for the summit. All right, today or this week, um, the touring cars are going to Summit Point. This is one of my absolute favorite combinations in iRacing. Um, one of my favorite races that I ever did was one of the ones at the end of my first season here with the touring cars at uh, Summit Point. I'll have it linked up here in the description. Um, back then I was doing about 17 and a half uh, for a good time there and I felt somewhat speedy in the splits I was in. Today, we got you a 115.895. I was stoked to get that and uh, super excited to share it with you and how I did it. So without further ado, let's show you the lap and uh, how we did it. That lap time was 16.09, sector 3 time is fast. Sector 1 time's okay. That lap was at 115.90. Yes. <laughs> quick. Woo. Okay. Um, it took a while, but we finally got a 115.895 for your lap here. And uh, let's go through how we did it. Um, first off, we're going to need a decent run up this straight. So we're just going to, you know, coming out of that last corner, we had to have a good one. Um, and we're just accelerating first, uh, first braking marker is going to be about here, um, at the three cone, um, where do we end up peaking? Let's see. Yeah. Right at the three, about 80%. Um, I've seen people turn out here, uh, turn in over here. I don't think it's the fastest you use this newer patch of pavement and even a little inside of that. I think, yeah. Apexing here, just trail out and then hit the throttle, just ease into it a little bit and go out and then we're just on it, full throttle, and then just kind of come around this corner here at speed and get over to this side of the track. Trying to use a little bit of this, uh, this here extra that they put there. And our next breaking point is going to be about here. That's probably too slow. Eh, it's even slower. Um, so we're going to peak just a little bit past that. About 50% on the brakes. Start turning in. Just doing a little dab to slow the car down enough that we don't overshoot. And um, we're turning in. We're going to come up on this side of the curb here. And um, press it a little bit. We're gonna use as much of this as we can, as we dare, and we're over it. Um, I'm gonna go outside and kind of show you where the car was through all of that. Let's go back. All right, so yeah. So we're breaking here, and then we're turning in, and use a little bit of that curb. Unsettles a little bit if you can avoid it. I would, but that is how I got my best time. 
just power through that that corner um accounts for a fair amount of your speed through the track here so it's important to get it spot on um and you're still gonna be quick if you don't but um for the absolute best times um on this we're just using as much of this as we can I'm not gonna break through this whole little section here we're just lifting a little bit just get down and we're gonna get back on the throttle just a smidge to settle the car out heavy braking zone here and be careful with cars behind you here too during an actual race but yeah just as soon as your car is going straight you're gonna 80 percent and then we're just gonna start to trail off come through this corner here trying to stay on this patch of new pavement quite a bit of wheel and we're powering out already Straighten the wheel out on it and then just a little bit of brakes to get the car turning again the other direction and then from here through this whole next little section we're just gonna uh, use the throttle to kind of control um, our understeer make sure we're not going off the track too much but we're full throttle shifting to fourth and yeah just lift a little bit so we don't go too far off We're trying to get our apex here back on it and we're going to get ready for this one here if you hit too much of this grass you're going to get an off track but uh use a little bit of it dropped off the throttle again just to get the car going to stay on this side of the track and we're lifting a little bit again just to again keep the car going where we want it we're locked in so full throttle and uh using as much of the track as we dare i want to get into the grass there and just full throttle all the way through here breaking point on this one is weird and hard to find um it's like in the middle of this here kind of by these uh, let's see it here so yeah about 50 percent staying in fifth fourth is going to slow me down too much i can't carry enough mid-speed corner that way and just trail and then there's bumps here it, this is this is hard this takes a lot of practice to find the kind of right path because your bumps are going to kind of throw you around but we're going to use all this uh all this pavement on the extra here to uh to get our as much as much acceleration as we can out of that corner and there you go we're through. I'm gonna go through that last corner one more time again. That's that's one I struggled with as well. We'll go on the outside here, kind of show you where the car is at. Um, but oh, there we go. So yeah, about halfway through that zone, there is where you peak, and it's just it's just a little one, about fifty percent. Uh, again, just to make sure we make it getting the car to bite in there are bumps here that you can't really see That like I said will upset the car and It makes it kind of hard. It throws it around. It makes it hard to get the absolute best run out of here as you can so it can be a little tough, but And I, as you can see with these tracks it it's easy to overshoot that so just be careful on there to get your good run out of here and you can use a little bit more than I did, but this was by far the best lap I had. It took me quite a bit to get it, and I am super duper proud of it. So, yeah. There you go. Once again, a 115.895. All right. So, yeah, 115.895. Super stoked. I think you could tell after I finished it, I was super happy to get that. It took a while of practicing to do that. Um, Folks, if you're um, finding these uh, helpful, uh, subscription to the the channel super duper helps out. Uh, at some point, we'll hit the metrics that YouTube wants us to hit, and uh, we'll be hunky dory. Um, thumbs up if you liked the video. Thumbs down if you didn't. Uh, head on over to twitch.tv slash man if you want to watch us uh, do some of these races live. And uh, yeah, till next time, you have a great one. Bye now.